Thank you. Plastic surgery is booming with the older generation, and now new technology lets them see the end results before undergoing the night. Let's see. Well, as we go through the day tomorrow, you may want to pile on the love with them. The baby boomer generation may be well into their 50s and 60s, but they're determined more than ever before not to look their age. In 2010, there were nearly 85,000 cosmetic surgical procedures among patients 65 and older. Facelifts and eyelid procedures ranked as the most popular among boomers. And now, for anyone considering cosmetic surgery, a new device is helping to ease some of the worry before patients undergo the knife. Channel 3's senior health correspondent Monica Robbins explains. Once upon a time, patients wanting a new nose, facelift, or breast enhancement could only imagine the results. The only other option is showing patients before and after pictures of similar patients, patients with at a similar age, similar body type, build. Like a lot of people considering surgery, Laura had concerns too. Would I look too young? Um, would it be too tight? Would, uh, um, would it not look natural? But certified plastic surgeon Dr. Jason Leedy was able to offer her some peace of mind in the form of a device called the Vectra M3 imaging system. Patients stand in front of a green screen, six high resolution cameras all focus on the desired spot and send the images to a computer. The information is used to create one 3D image that can be viewed from any angle. It then allows me to manipulate the body part that we're working on. So if it's the neck, I can tighten up the neck and show them what changes. If it's liposuction, we can, I can adjust those areas that we're going to work on and they can then see exactly what will happen. It really, really helped me to understand um, where exactly what would happen and um, and how I would look. It managed my expectations, I think is the best way to put it. Using those pictures, Dr. Leedy is able to show patients what their own body or face will look like after the procedure. And that's helping patients like Laura go into surgery with realistic expectations. It was what convinced me that I was doing the right thing. And come out happy with the results. Amazingly close. Uh, right down to certain lines. He has said certain lines would stay, certain lines would go. Monica Robbins, Channel 3 News. 3D imaging system is helpful in many different types of cosmetic procedures, including showing the patient what injectable fillers would look like on their own face. Now, there are a few procedures that it's not ideal for, such as breast reduction. You can find more info about this on WKYC.com. Listen to this. Tanning...